Alright, Shalom. Shalkabar, Bun Yahweh, Bun Yahshua Allah. I'd like to give praise to you, Hawaii Shema Shah. Double honors to the elders, apostles, a great millstone. Salutation to the alchemist that's pushing his word, truth. Alright. Alright, this is um, my motivation. This is about um, being deceived, man. You know? A lot of people being deceived, man, and um, preaching false doctrine, man, to um, mess up the minds of the simple. So, <clears throat> I'm going to get into some scriptures. I got a few scriptures that I'm going to get into real quick. I'm going to start off with 2 Thessalonians chapter 2, verse 3. It says, Let no man deceive you by any means, for that day shall not come except there come a falling away first. Right. You no. Know, falling away means basically, you know, falling away basically means forsake. Unless you be forsaken. You know what I'm saying? The Lord, if the Lord ain't dealing with you, then you easily be deceived. And also being, you know, defection, always being defected from the truth as well. So, if the Lord don't want you to get it, man, he ain't, he ain't actually choose you to get it. You know? So, that's, 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 some, that's part of being simple. And and basically letting um letting any man <clears throat> any man tell you tell you anything. You know what I'm saying? Without researching or looking it up. You know. Say let no man deceive you by any means. Under no circumstances, man. Let nobody just you no know, deceive you, man. Even though these churches, even though these churches on Sundays, man, they're being deceived, man, week in and week out, man. Alright? Locked. Um, read no one to say, for that day shall not come except there come falling away first, and that man of sin revealed. Who is that man of sin? Esau, man. All right. You say the son of prediction. It means means destruction. So basically, you know, um, if you're being deceived by other doctrines and other um false false deities man is basically you heading for destruction you know all right um moving moving on i'm gonna go to galatians chapter six galatians chapter six 6 and 3. Galatians chapter 6 verse 3. It says, for, for if a man think himself to be something when he is nothing, he deceiving himself, man. So, if basically, that's basically being high-minded. You know, think you know more than more than your teachers. You got, you got, you got niggas that fell out the truth thinking they know more than their elders and more than their apostles. You know, not being humble, you know, not being, you know, you know, rooted, you know, and um, thinking highly of yourself, you know, think you got the best knowledge, the most knowledge than others, and that's what it's talking about. Say for if in, for if a man think himself to be something, when he is nothing, right? You ain't shit, man. You ain't shit in this truth, man. You just a servant. We all servants of this truth, man. All right. We servants, man. We ain't, we ain't, we ain't on, we is not on the, uh, we is not, we is not on the high total pole. All right. Uh, read on. We basically doing the work of your how about Shema Ushai. It say, uh, for if a man think himself to be something when he is nothing, he deceiving himself. Right. You deceiving yourself, man. You know. Being this and being that and being all high-minded and stuff like that. That's when the Lord destroy you, man. That's being proud. You know, a lot of, a lot of, a lot of people think that you know you know more than others. You know, on that proud shit, think the Lord ain't gonna deal with you, man. You know, that's why you gotta stay humble. You know, and do the do the work. All right. I'm gonna make this real quick. Um, I'm gonna go to Second Timothy three and thirteen. Of Second Timothy three and thirteen. All right. 
All right, Second Timothy, chapter three, verse thirteen. It says, "But evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse, deceiving and being deceived." So the Lord, the Lord put a demon on um, the ones that deceiving. And he put a demon on the ones that's being deceived. So that's a win-win right there, man. Because the Lord basically can give y'all a strong delusion, man. That's when the strong delusion come into play. You know what I'm saying? Being deceived and deceiving at the same time, man. And that's and and and, and, and basically that's that's part of your destruction. I'm gonna read it one more time. It say uh Second Timothy 3 and 13 say, but evil men, but evil but evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse. Right? Look at um, look at the look at the doctrine that's been pushing out lately, man. About you know, not obeying your masters and all that. Basically, man, that 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 Colossians four and one cuts that. So, you know, deceiving and being deceived, man. That's not really um, that's not really of the Lord, man. You say. Um, but evil men and seducers shall wax worse and worse, deceiving and being deceived. So basically, um, you you teach a false doctrine and you receiving false false doctrine, salakia, at the same time, man. So the Lord is not dealing with deceiving and being deceived. So basically, if the Lord don't want you, you know, he's he's basically going to put a, a lying spirit in your mind, you know, to to make you go off. You know, what I'm saying if the Lord ain't dealing with you, if he's casting you out. You're going to teach any and everything, man. It don't got nothing to do with the scriptures. All right. Um, I'm going to go to Romans 16 and 18. Romans chapter 16, verse 18. Alright, this is Romans 16 and 18. He said, For they that are such serve not our Lord Yahweh, but their own belly. <laughs> you know, you serving Yahweh, you ain't serving Yahweh, you serving other gods, man. You know what I'm saying? Your own belly, man, your own mind, your own um you know, your your own um opinion, you know. And by good words and fair speeches. Deceive the hearts of the simple, man. So, so for those that be, for those that be, you know, learning, learning from other um groups and stuff like that. You know, being, you know, the simple, you know, what I'm saying, want to want to learn the truth. You give them a false doctrine. You know, what I'm saying, and the Lord is not dealing with that. I'm gonna read it one more time. Say Romans sixteen and eighteen. Say for they, for they that are such serve not other serve. Salakia, for they that are such serve not our our Lord Yahweh Hamashiach, but their own belly, man. You making up your own doctrine. You serving your own God. You think you God yourself, which you're not. You know what I'm saying? It say, but their own belly, and by good words and fair speeches, right? Because you understand, man. A lot of, lot of, lot of, lot of people don't know what's going on and don't have no idea and you give them you give them the wrong doctrine you know what I'm saying with with um <laughs> with good words and, and and fair speeches which deceives the hearts of the simple man the word heart goes back to the Hebrew word live means your mind so you deceiving the minds of the simple you know and the Lord gonna kill you for that shit man <laughs> all right and that's why that's why um that's why the Lord raised up great millstone to bring the truth out week in and week out, man. All over the all over the states, all over the world, all through the internet, so the simple can get the truth, man, and and be built up, you know, strong. All right. All right, moving on. I'm gonna go to First Timothy four and sixteen. First Timothy, chapter four, verse sixteen. It say, take heed unto yourself, unto the doctrine. Continue in them, for in doing this thou shalt both save thyself 
and them that fear thee. All right. I'm reading one more time. It say First Timothy chapter four verse sixteen. It say Take heed unto yourself. Right. Be circumspect. You know what I'm saying? Watch what you study, man. Watch what you learning. You know what I'm saying? Understand what you read until you um, venture off into some other, um, you know, some other um, activities, man. All right. Add unto and 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 unto the doctrine. The doctrine is, you know, what I'm saying the truth out the scriptures, man. The I have the ID chip, the race wars, all right, the concentration camps, the martial law. That's the doctrine we teaching, man. All right. Um. Um. Cornelius is an Israelite, which he is. That's the doctrine. That's the true doctrine we teaching. Um. What else? One third and 144,000 will be delivered in the end time. You know what I'm saying? Yahweh Shai finna say the elect. The Lord only deal with the elect. The Lord finna kill off the two thirds, which is our which is our people. Wickedness of our people, blacks, Latins, and Native Americans. You know what I'm saying? Um Joseph and Mary Joseph and Mary had sex. Alright. Mary didn't have Yahweh Shai just birth Yahweh Shai out of nowhere. No, it's bullshit. And that's what you call uh you no know, uh you know unto the doctrine. You gotta take heed unto thyself and unto the doctrine that our elders the apostles teach, you know what I'm saying, according to the scriptures, man. They sit down lessons, you know. And um, if, if things I forgot, man, hey, 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 remind me, man, you know. Um, it's like you. Yeah, this camera keep going out, so I'm going to keep on rolling. Yeah, man, just, uh, just take heed unto the doctrine that the elders taught and that our apostles taught. All right. Um, it say medit, medit, It say take heed unto thyself and unto the doctrine. Continue in them. Right. We gotta continue in them until that day come, until America be destroyed, man. White man's the devil. America finna be destroyed. You know what I'm saying? Um, Rush finna nuke this place. ICBM missiles. See, a lot of these groups ain't teaching that. You know what I'm saying? They, ain't, they they's not taking heed unto themselves and unto the doctrine. All right. It say, for in doing this, thou shalt both save thyself. It means work out your salvation. You know, in fear and trembling, pray always in your mind or, or out loud. You know what I'm saying? Out loud. You know what I'm saying? But don't be not seen of men. You know what I'm saying? Or you can pray in your house out loud, or you pray in your mind wherever you, you know if you leave your house, whatever. Um, it say, take heed unto thyself and unto the doctrine, continue in them. For in doing this, thou shalt both save thyself and them that fear thee. You know what I'm saying? You save yourself by, you know, doing what your how about Shema was shy say. You know, that's how you save yourself. And following order. That's how you save yourself and having faith. You know what I'm saying? And also, these other groups don't teach that, you know, ain't no, um, Faith based, faith based Israelites and all that stuff, man. You know what I'm saying? Faith, faith is a substance of things that's hoped for, man. You know what I'm saying? It is. So you can't see faith, but you know if you got faith, then that's when you got faith in Yahweh Shah, man. That's when you the real man of the Lord, and hopefully we are the elect, man. Just can't say you're the elect. You know I'm the elect. Just jump out something. No, you gotta, gotta really do, you gotta really do the work. Got to do the work, man. You know what I'm saying? And plus, faith basically being outside every Saturday. You know what I'm saying? You got angels around us, camped around us. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, and basically, you know, getting tested and stuff like that. This is a good scripture, too. It say, uh, 1 Timothy 4 and 16, Take heed unto thyself and unto the doctrine. Right, the doctrine of great millstone, man, because we got the 100% truth. Continue in them, for in doing this, thou shalt both save thyself. And them that fear thee, right, man. You basically, you know, what I'm saying, you <laughs> basically, you know, when you got the truth, you telling the truth to other, you know, what I'm saying to the other brothers that want to come in this thing, man. You know, what I'm saying it depends, you know, the spirit. If the spirit jump on you, you know, what I'm saying to tell, um, 
tell certain brothers what's going on. You know what I'm saying? Um, the Lord is black. <laughs> you know, Yahweh Shai, so-called Jesus Christ, who is his name ain't Jesus. His name is Yahweh Shai. You know what I'm saying? He's a black man, all right? You know, America finna be destroyed. You know, it's finna be martial law. You know what I'm saying? Um, RFID, RFID chip. You know what I'm saying? The, uh, the micro chip finna come. You know what I'm saying? That's what we teach, man. That's doctrine. You know what I'm saying? That's a doctrine. That, that's a true doctrine. All right? Um, this last scripture. I'm going to go to First Timothy. I'm going to 1 Timothy 6 and 1. Basically, you know what I'm saying? You, you saving him. Saving. Actually, you saving him. You know what I'm saying? They heal you. You know what I'm saying? You saving him out the fire. You pulling him out the fire. You know what I'm saying? You, you washing your hands. You know what I'm saying? Basically, you know, uh, you washing the blood off your hands, man. You know what I'm saying? That hears you and taking heed for him to come to the truth so he can save himself from the destruction that's going to come. All right? Now, moving on, 1 Timothy 6 and 1. 1 Timothy chapter 6, verse 1. It say, Let as many servants as, as are under the yoke count their own masters worthy of all honor that the name of the Most High and his doctrine be not blasphemy, man. That's like that's like Nate in uh, IUIC saying Jesus Christ, Jesus Christ, Christ. You know what I'm saying? That's not his name, man. His name is Yahweh Shai. I'm reading one more time. First Timothy 6 and 1 say, Let many servants as are under the yoke count their own masters worthy of all honor. Right, who was our masters, man? The elders. They were the that's every every time we um start camp, we always say double honors to our elders, man. All right. That the name of the Most High and our Master Yahweh Shai. All right, that's our Master. And plus, you gotta plus you gotta obey your Master on Earth too. You know what I'm saying? Cause he get he got the truth. You know what I'm saying? They got the truth. You know what I'm saying? Come come from the uh, Apostle. You know it's order. It's all about order, man. Let 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 as many servants as are under the yoke count their own masters worthy of all honor. <laughs> That the name of the Most High and His doctrine be not blasphemy. Right, we ain't teaching blasphemy, man. You know, you, you saying that um, two thirds, two thirds um, not gonna be saved. All Israel gonna be saved. That's blasphemy, man. You saying uh, Cornelius is, is not an Israelite? That's blasphemy, man. You saying Mary? Mary, um, Mary and Joseph didn't have sex. That's blasphemy, you know. Uh, IFID chip is an embargo. It's Christianity. That's blasphemy. All right, you know all this, all this stuff. These other um, Israelite groups teaching that um, um, GLCC basically saying uh, mermaids and shit. That's blasphemy, man. You know. Um, what else, man? It's a lot of it's a lot of stuff going on, man, in this thing, man. Uh, that got a curve, that man. It, it saying the Earth is flat, that's blasphemy. The Earth is round, man. It's not fucking flat. All right. That tell you that the Lord is not dealing dealing with him. You know, that's part of um. That's that that that's part of that's part of being simple and being deceived. You know that's that's really um that's really being unfaithful. All right, saying um you know it uh Edomites Edomites gonna be saved, other nations gonna be saved. Hell no, nah. hell no, nah. that's blasphemy right there, man. If I have got some, hey, like me on it. But um basically um I'm real more time. I'm gonna close out. Um First Timothy six. And uh, one, they say, let as many servants as are under the yoke count their own masters, worthy of all honor, that the name of the Most High and his doctrine be not blasphemy, man. No. So this doctrine that we in, man, is truth, 100% truth. You know, and um, with that, I'd like to say, Kahalai Havashimau Shai, this is another motivation. And, um, Salutation to the brothers that's pushing this word and truth. And uh, Shalom. And I hope y'all was edified.